Hello there everyone, it is Marky Mark, and today I wanted to pop in with a very quick video on the removal process of the Young Nail Full Cover Tips. I did have a viewer who was interested in knowing if they were easily able to be popped off or if it took gorilla strength to be able to remove these. And I'm glad that I had a video because honestly I forgot on how I removed these like exactly and I forgot how long or how short it took. So it was in my camera roll and I'm like, heck yeah, this actually worked in my favor today, right? So here we are. So in this video, to remove everything, I just used nail clippers, pure acetone, a nail file, and a cuticle pusher. And so you see me clipping off that extra length with the nail clippers, and then I went in with the nail file and removed the design and the gel polish that was on top. So that way I wasn't sitting in the manicure bowl for 1500 hours waiting for layer after layer after layer after layer to come off. So after I have filed majority of the gel polish off of the top, I just take that pure acetone, pour it into my manicure bowl, and I sit there and I just soak. And so you'll see me come in and out of the manicure bowl and use the cuticle pusher and the nail file. But this first segment of me sitting in the manicure bowl took 12 minutes. Now I'm just using the cuticle pusher and trying to scrape off gently whatever I can scrape off to see if I need to go back in or if it's good and I definitely needed to go back in. And you'll see me dip my cuticle pusher into the acetone just to kind of wet it a little bit because it did start to dry, like the actual nail started to dry on me and I didn't want to just start scraping at dry product because that kind of freaks me out sometimes so I just wanted it to still be a little bit wet so then after I finish that I take my manicure bowl and I put my fingernails back into that bowl and this segment of me soaking was about five minutes and now I'm just repeating the process with the cuticle pusher. I'm gonna shorten it just because I did it already in the beginning half and I don't want this video to be terribly long. And then once I was done with the cuticle pusher and the nails were like somewhat dry, I went in with the nail file to remove any of the excess like parts that I was scraping up. And that way I was able to assess if I had any of that full coverage tip left on my nail plate. So at this part, I went back into the manicure bowl and the acetone for another two minutes, used the cuticle pusher and the nail file like I did in the beginning, and the nails were completely removed. I didn't have any damage. I didn't have any issues removing them. So it did take a little bit of time, but it wasn't horrible. From the beginning to the end of the raw footage video, it was a 34 minute video. And when I added up all of the time that I was sitting and soaking, it was only 20 minutes. So yeah, it wasn't too, too bad. I hope that this video did help. So yeah, just let me know down in the comments below if this video was helpful and beneficial. This was just the way that I saw fit to remove this product personally. This is by no means the only way to remove it. Young nails themselves may even have a different way. So until next time, Marky Mark out.